Good morning, everyone. For today, we're going to discuss the new topic. But before that, let us pray. So today, we're going to discuss the vertical test and the function. First, we have function. The word function is used in many things. It tells us where, whether a certain relation is a function. The questions that we have is, are all relation is function? It is important to answer. So let us find out. In this example, this type of relation is one to many because we have one element corresponding in two element in the second element. Based on the definition of relation and function, it implies that all functions are relation, but not all functions are relation. Thus, the first ordered pair involved solid was paired twice in both book and pencil. Therefore, there are not function. It is mere relation. So, in the previous slide, it shows that it is not a function. It is only a relation. To identify if the given order pair is a function, we should know the definition of a function. So a function is a relation in which each element in of a domain is paired with exactly one element in the range. So in that, it implies that all functions are relation, but not all relation are function. So let us have an example. Determine whether each relation is a function. So in letter A, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So it is a function. Each element of a domain is paired with exactly one element of the range. That's, this relation is a function. In letter B, in X, we have negative 3, negative 1, 0, 1, 3. And Y is 5, 5, 5, 5. By the use of mapping diagram, in the given example, so we paired all elements in the domain exactly in one element in the range. It means this example is a function. In letter C, we use the mapping diagram to show that we have a not a function because the domain 20 paired twice to the range. Another tip to find if the ordered pair is a function. We know the three kinds of correspondence or relation. First, the one-to-one -one correspondence. Second one, we have the many-to-one correspondence. And the third one, we have one-to-many correspondence. So, in one-to-one -one correspondence, it is definitely exactly that it is a function. In many-to-one, it is also a function. Why? We can have the element in the domain, which is exactly paired in element in one element in the range how about the many to one so if i have
one element paired in the two element in the range, it must be one to many, right? But, if you have seen in the previous slide, you see it is merely not a function. It is only a relation. So, if the relation that shows in the ordered pair is an example of many, is an example of one to many, it is not a function. So, for now, let us have another types to find if it is function or not. By the use of, so now, this will be the other guide to identify if it is function or not. So, we're going to use this if the given is a graph. The vertical line test. If every vertical line intersects the graph not more than once, the graph represents a function. So, let us have an example. So, in letter A, the first picture, it is function because the vertical line test intersect the graph at one point. Letter B, it is only a relation, not a function because it intersect the graph using 2.02 2 and 0, negative 2. Letter C, function because the graph represents a linear functions and the domain is not repeated. D it is relation because the domain is repeated. And last it is also relation because the the point two and negative two and two negative two obviously show in the graph and the domain is repeated so to identify by the, the a function by this a vertical line we must know the domain if the domain is repeated it is not a function it just a merely relation another example Determine the domain and the range of the, fun 